Hello everyone, my name is Karen and today I will talk to you about the point of view I have about feminism. Okay, so first of all, what is feminism? Feminism is a movement that looks to achieve equality for all. It is the belief that women should be allowed to have the same rights, power, opportunities as men and to be treated in the same way or the activities intend to achieve this state. The first wave of this movement started in the 19th and 20th century with women demanded equal rights and the right to vote. At the second wave, feminism took place approximately between the 60s and 90s and this movement was primarily focused on equality, discrimination, sexuality and reproductive rights. About the third wave, the f movement started in the 1990s and continues until today. And also some argue that we are now entering to a fourth feminist wave, but this is nothing sure, this is all up for debate. Well, I have to say that I decided to talk about this because here in Mexico we have experienced certain feminist marches that have been a problem or caused damages to the cities and the citizens. Many people expressed that women and even men that support this movement are crazy and that the way they are fighting for rights is the wrong one because it can be considered as aggressive and this is how my opinion starts. If you haven't seen news about the walks situation of feminism here in Mexico, let me explain some of the most relevant cases. Okay, so this example is from the newspaper El Universal, which says, Feminist protest against gender violence in Mexico City. That's the title of the article. It says, on Friday, Mexican women through the country marched against sexual crimes and the lack of action of authorities to punish offenders. Sexual violence in Mexico is on the rise and the lack of action and impunity allowed by authorities have only worsened the problem. Every six minutes, a Mexican woman is raped. Nine out of a ten sexual offenses are made by men, and most offenders are never punished, and victims are often blamed for the situation. Women were seen carrying banners with messages like, if they kill me, if they rape me, if they disappear me, destroy it all. They are killing us and you do nothing. It's going to fall. It's going to fall. Or not one less. We want justice. Unfortunately, some groups of women committed vandalism by throwing stones, fire extinguishers, bombs and firecrackers as well as gases and paint. Some units of the Metrobus suffered damages as well as the station Insurgentes which was closed due to severe damage. The subway station Insurgentes was also closed. This happened in Mexico City. Okay, so basically this note tells us that feminist marches here in Mexico City have been chaotic because women have fought but they haven't done it with respect. They have damaged the cities. So this is where my opinion starts. Okay, so first of all, I think that people are right. The way that 
most or some of the feminists are expressing or fighting is aggressive and rude, basically without respect. And this is because how are they asking for respect, disrespecting the streets and other people? I mean, I think that it's okay to ask for equal treatment and respect to the rights of both genders and of course because this is a good thing that benefits and protects everyone but that's not the correct way to do it I am a woman and I obviously want justice for all those who were raped, killed or who suffered violence even a kind of discrimination from anyone especially from a man and I understand how it feels when someone treats you disrespectful or violent because of course I've been through it in my short life but I'm not the one who fights for justice with violence or an aggressive attitude because if we protest like this we are not going to obtain what we want because we are asking for respect, for protection, for justice in the same way that we are receiving this treatment. So from my point of view, we should protest and make our voice to be listened but with respect and knowing that what we give is what we receive. So the point is to ask for equal treatment and for justice for the ones that are not anymore with us with respect.